Hey guys, it's me, Jemmy, and I'm going to be doing a box packing video for Lulu. Um, I've actually called him Mason, but uh, I don't know what his mama's gonna call him. Anywho, so yeah, I'm gonna get started with his box packing. Uh, I think he's actually a pickup, but I still would prefer him to be, you know, packed up and ready to go when she gets here. This way she doesn't have to wait too long. Um, anywho, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get Mason ready to go. So let me grab a box. I just gotta take my sweater off. It's awfully warm in here. Okay, so... This is the box I'm using. It's pretty large, and yeah, it, it was lined with something I had. It's a pretty large box, empty, of course. Start with the please start your box opening video. And that goes face down at the bottom of the box. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and put some of these, if you can see those, I don't know. Oh my goodness, you can't see anything with this. Um, the peanut bags at the bottom, because it is a larger box. I don't want it to be like super flopping around and everything, but, you know, I also want to make sure the box is big enough for him. Because he's a, a fairly large baby, and he's got a lot of stuff going home with him. Now this is the premium package that she ordered. As you can see, it looks like that. Um, the premium package comes with a few more things than my economy package does when doing custom orders. So, um, it comes with some extra outfits and everything's brand new versus um, pre-owned items. So, I'm going to go ahead and actually put this bag on the bottom of the box. Um, because if she does end up needing to just... Uh, get them shipped, then I have that already set up. So I'm gonna move the box out of the way and get the rest of this together. I'm gonna actually just pack everything up to start with, and uh, then I'll put it in the box as I go. Hopefully, you can see somewhat what's going on. Maybe. Alright, so I have this cute little pair of sunglasses that are going home with him, and I will put um. Yeah, his pacifier. I don't usually do modified pacifiers because I'm not sure if they want to modify them or not. So I'm going to actually leave the pacifier alone. Um, you can cut the just a little bit off the tip and it actually would fit in Lulu's mouth or Mason's mouth because he's got a relatively open mouth actually. So I'm going to go ahead and put those together like so and wrap them up. I like wrapping things up a little more individually, if I can. So you can see a little package there. You can get some more tissue paper here. Don't mind my, my, um, my little sweater is like fraying really bad. I don't know what that's about. Um, some little, uh, sandals. They're, they're so cute. I don't know if they're sharks or dinosaurs or what they are. I think they're sharks because there's little sharks on the inside. But they were so stinking cute and I found those and they're like the right size for his feet. So I was like, wow, that's just perfect. Little pair of socks that are going home with him. It's a little like that. So I'm going to go ahead and put those together as well. Oh, got lots of tissue paper on that pile. Apparently. I'm going to go ahead and double that one because it's got some stuff in there that might um, peek through a little. Go ahead and put that there. And we've got his diapers. Uh, these diapers might be a little smaller for him, but all I have are size 1s usually because I don't usually use such large kits. But some of the Kapow Bam ones, some little camo airplane ones, and just a regular pink purse. The pamper should fit no problem, actually, but the other two, I have one of the, um, one of that size on him now, and it seems to fit okay, um, but she might want to go up just a little bit, just a little bit, and get my tissue paper. I don't, I don't have it really set up properly here today. 
one in a proper setup. Okay, so we have a little photo album. Um, typically, I do put pictures in the photo album. I just like to um, make sure they have a photo album going home with a premium. Um, today, apparently, Walmart decided that even though I ordered all his photos online, they decided they were not going to actually fill the order and their machine is down and um, they decided not to even call or let me know the machine was down and that my paying extra for our pickup did no good at all. So I'm going to send the frame or the uh, album home with him, but I'm going to uh, get the pictures done and then I'll mail them to her a little bit later on. Mom, once I get those photos back, um, because I don't really have a choice, unfortunately. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not showing you. This is his little outfit, one of the outfits that's going home with him. It's a little jacket, pants, and I run the ship. Um, these are all brand new, so they should, because of the darker colors, they should definitely be washed before wearing. Um, I honestly would wash at least twice before wearing. Uh, just because you don't want any of the dye coming off from the clothes onto him. So that's just my opinion on that. What's up, babe? Um, what? Huh? Oh, okay. Well, just give me. You can ask me real quick, but I gotta get the stuff. My, I don't, my phone is not going to last too long. Um, maybe, but let's talk about that a little bit later on when I'm not in the middle of it, okay? Yeah, after the video. Okay. Alright, go. Skadoodle. Alright, so actually, I'm not going to wrap the outfits up because... It's just not, they don't fit with the hangers. Um, so I'll lay them at the bottom and cover them up. This I will wrap. It's his little, I like big trucks and I cannot lie because it's funny as heck. And the onesies fit fine. These. They fit just fine. There's that. Um. um Alright, so this is his other outfit that I have. A little sleepy outfit. Comes with this cute little puppy hat. And little puppy pants and shirt. Super cute. So like I said, I'm going to actually lay those out. This is the hanger and the tags that go with the outfit he's got on. That he's going home in. And he's got a white onesie underneath that. And this is his teddy bear. And his teddy bear is not going to be in a bag. It's going to be out. Hey! Hey! Out! My dogs are losing their mind as usual. Alright, so let's get this party started. Let's go ahead and start getting this stuff ready to go in the box. Um, I'll actually wrap them up last. But I do want to get everything out of the way. See, I'm just putting a bear butt in your face. Okay, so I'm going to... Oh, I'm sorry. I am going to wrap him up first and put him in. I am going to do that. Duh. Alright, so he's got to go at the bottom of the box because that's how we roll. This is a little blanket. You can see. Little sheepies. Obviously, I really like the color gray and I like blue. So you will see me use gray and blue a lot, especially now I've decided they're pretty much the only colors I'll be using. I guess it's a very small blanket. We might have to double that up a little. All right. So we'll do that. We might have to get him a secondary blanket actually, or cover up his tootsies one or the other. Oh, and here he is anyway. There he is, all cute like. His hair, cute baby head, little hands. I did a few other videos of him, so I'm not like gonna go not showing you um, because there's already a bunch of videos of him. I am going to. Jeez, baby. Gonna cover his little head up. 
that's kind of important. And I don't think I'm going to be able to get his tootsies in here, actually. I don't think so. His tootsies are too big. Uh, you know what? We will wrap his tootsies up. In. In. Oh, I know what we'll do. I know what we'll do. Ha 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 ha. I know what we'll do, baby. We are going to wrap your little head up in some sushi paper. Like a cereal. This way they can't see your cute little face. Right away. It's a little more of a surprise. She gets some tape on them. But that'll do for right now. I'm going to go ahead and get him wrapped up and then we'll get that situated a little bit better. Alright, so we'll wrap his legs up. Like that. We'll get his arms tucked in nice and neat. Like so. Like a sir. And then wrap him up real good and snug as bug. And we're gonna get another piece of tissue paper. Just work with me here. Let me make sure I have time on my thing. Yeah, I'm good. Um I'm just gonna plug in tissue paper in and around him so that you know how we are. We like to unwrap the babies little by little. Little by little. And she's seen. Um, my doll's in person, too. I'm not sure if I know what to expect for the most part, but I still like them wrapped up. Wrapped up. There we go. There's that. I'm gonna go ahead and get this box up here so I can put them in, in there. I'm gonna move the box out of the way. Actually, yeah, let me put them in the box first, because otherwise I've got all this stuff. Come on, baby. He's heavy as heck. So now I will show you. Oh, well, I'll show you all that junk over there instead. Here he is in the box, all nice and neat and comfy and covered. And I wish I had a higher stand. Well, maybe I can raise that up a little. Aha! There we go. There we go. That's a little better at least. Let me go ahead and get his outfits and put them in here. I'm going to get a tissue paper first. And put the tissue paper over top of him this way. If his stuff shifts around a little, we don't have to worry about uh, the clothing touching him directly. Like that. I'm awfully short to be doing this this high. I wish I had tried this one on the floor, to be honest. But I'm remodeling my house, and there's too much. I have too much stuff around right now to actually like have him down on the floor, packing up because there's just too much junk everywhere. Because I have to move things from like room to room, and I'm a total hoarder anyway. So, 
Oh, it's not good, man. All right, now you can see that he is completely covered. Let you see. We'll take his two extra outfits. Like that. And we're just gonna actually lay those right on top, like so. I'll actually put the lighter one on the bottom this way. Um, you know, you don't have to stress over anything touching anywhere it shouldn't be touching. Any touching that shouldn't be curling. There we go. We do this nice and neatly. Nice and neatly. With my tiny little arms. Alright. Sorry about that. There you go. See? Everything's nice and neat like that. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little more tissue paper to it off. So, yeah, like I said, I sent them home with three outfits, the premium ones. And uh, they're usually wearing one of those outfits home. Because, you know, the outfits are cute and I want them to go home in something cute. And each outfit, I actually don't 